this is Blown Deadline on Epic Elite. And so this is another quest that has a lot of items I need. It has four items total. Uh, I don't necessarily have to get all of them, but if I get, you know, if I get some, that's fantastic. Uh, I can get, it has a, a ring, which I could put um, a tw plus 21 stat on with dodge 21, improved deception, profane well rounded, which gives you plus two to all my stats. Uh, it has goggles that lets me have a ability plus 21, insightful ability plus 10, and quality resistance plus 4 to my saves. And it, and it gives me an MRR bonus for religious feats, which is great with my paladin levels. Then there's some uh, gloves that uh, gives me insightful double strike, seeker 21, insightful deadly. Um, I had those same gloves, ironically. I, actually, a lot of these items I've had, I have now, I had the heroic versions of. Um, and then there's the Bracers, which has Devotion, Healing Lore, and Sightful Sheltering. So that's really more of a uh, Cleric type item, but it's going to help myself healing and give me a little bit more uh, physical sheltering. And that's actually physical and magical sheltering, so that's really cool. All right. You arrive at the world I'm going to bring my hireling out. A temple dedicated to the god of wealth, located in the pulsing heart of Sharn. The main temple is just close to its doors. You wonder why Kolkaran's high priest wants to meet with you after hours. An imposing man dressed in a noble's finery beckons you in the main courtyard. And there's more items in this quest, uh, but there's also a lot of, a lot, almost all of them I need, the so. Take the sky coach at the end of the north. I probably won't get them all the first run like I did last time, but if I can get, you know, one of Sharn's one item uh, here and there, that would be great. Lucian Vaunt and has selected you to deliver the killing blow against his new manufacturer. Particularly those bracers, that's probably the thing I most want to get. You arrive at your destination after a long flight to the forest of towers that comprises the middle Memphis district. To your surprise, Vaunt's Dura warehouse is a drab and unremarkable structure. The entrance is unguarded, so you slip inside. After a moment of stunned silence, the guards go the Intruders! Activate the alarm spells! Fall down the entire tower! So the Vaunt guards are pretty deadly in here. My MRR is terrible. In the hall behind you. And, uh, the, um, they're... Damage is not. Their force damage is not available. And so since streak bonus is um, not part of the Reaper computation, I don't think I'm going to lose uh, anything from Reaper for running this quest on Elite first. But if I do, it's no big deal. I mean, I need the gear. I'm just not up to snuff. Um, and so this is good. So I think... I'm gonna try to. I might try to look and see if there's any other gear sets, pieces of gear that. Um, there's one or more, one or two more quests like this I could run. Some items.
And so I'm already noticing a difference from his physical sheltering. Like, I already notice I'm taking less damage. It's really nice. As you open the first valve, the pipes in the room begin to rupture and steam hisses from the cracks. Another pipe breaks, and the machinery itself begins to shudder. The final lever causes the temperature in the room to flare up as system breaks down. It suddenly gives way beneath your feet. The rumbling plane is further down the passage. So I'm not sure why I'm the only one getting uh, hit by these sticky traps, if it's because you I'm just getting unlucky, or if my save is the issue. My saves are actually okay-ish. The level. Rupturous heat and concussive force tear through the building as the main manufacturing A gnome roars at you as you enter the room. My wonderful equipment! How could you destroy it like that? You'll pay for this travesty! Alright, we got some... We gotta get rid of these... Alright, well I got the uh, bracers I wanted. 
Reducing the uh, area I think somebody must have passed those because I got this one and I don't think they would pass those. I'm going to pass this to Karani because I think he might be able to find use for that. And these bracers are appealing to me because they give, they have devotion, healing lore, and then insightful sheltering, which is a very rare uh, affix to have on an item. And I need it. So what do I have here right now? Charisma. So I have to play a little bit of gear Tetris to make this all work. But definitely this is going to be part of my gear set. And that is Blown Deadline on Elite. I'll probably run some more of these. I don't think I'll record uh, all of them just because it's kind of repetitive. But I'm going to try to get a couple more items if I can.